Ni Hao, Washi, Harley, Lazo, Vemo. Last week, E C clicks and an attacker disposable e-cig. In my eyes the same as every other pod, disposable pod store of use but these called e-cigarettes. So we're going to call them e-cigarettes because that's what we're called. E-cig clicks in these for the purpose of review. So I'm going to do a really quick fast paced through review. Let you know what we think, talk about specs, talk about what's not so good on them. That's how it goes. Enjoy. Now the first interesting thing about these devices is everywhere I sell them says they're from Xiaomi, I think that's how you spell it, they say it. And that's not true, they're actually affiliated with a company called Beijing Konjac Technology Company, Limited, I think. There is some people that work for Taka that are affiliated, used to work or do work for Xiaomi but they are not actually directly connected in regards to companies. So, the first thing I noticed about this is it's in a nice little fancy box. It's got a magnetic opening. And inside, it really does shine out at you. Inside, you've got five different flavors, all snugly fit. For the space of you, you might not like it because the box is quite a lot deeper than it needs to be. But I like it, it's going to be an extra mile to make it look nicer. And I do also like there's a little pull string to help you lift them out, because if not it would be virtually impossible. The box is open with the ripcord type fastening. Easily sealed packets. And then inside, <coughs> then inside the packet, we've got the rubber caps, which fit quite nicely. So that's the inside of the packaging. Let's talk about some specific information, specifications. The 94 mil long by 16 and a half mil wide by 7.4 mil thick. So pretty thin, quite nice on your fingers. LED. They're all in 1.5 milliliter liquid. And if they reckon you're gonna get about 400 puffs per disposable system. And that's all powered by a 280 milliamp hour battery. They all use 50 milligram nicotine. And I know there's a few of you out there that are very conscious of the environment, which you should be, it's a good thing. So you're thinking disposable pods, plastic, oh god. Let me tell you, these are metal. We've got plastic in the ends, just a little bit for the caps, but they are predominantly made up of metal. Let's take a closer look at the flavours. We've got flu cured tobacco, iced coffee, iced lychee, Blueberry Burst and Mung Bean Ice. Now, I haven't tried Mung Bean Ice, but it's quite nice flavour. It tastes quite cucumber to me. The coffee tastes like any standard coffee, but it's got menthol in it, so it gives you a really nice creamy kick. It is quite nice. The blueberry tastes exactly like blueberry, really good. The, do, 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 do. the tobacco one's quite uh, subtle. It's nice, relatively nice. And lychee, I've never had lychee before, so I went on balsam. And it's not very potent flavour, but I don't think light cheese are. So it's quite decent like that. Now, it says it's going to give 400 puffs. And I had my little clicky counter out. I don't know where it is, so it's in my pocket. I had my little clicky counter out. And each device got around 250. The average puff count for each one was 250. I think the highest puffs I got were 265. Just for demonstration purposes, I'll show you how to... Puff. Nice. Yeah, so maybe I'm taking too long drags, you could say, I suppose, if you're a bit pedantic. But I think it's a bit weak. I do think 260 puffs is quite a gen uh, 250 puffs is quite genuine. And I think it's quite a good expectation as well. So maybe if you dropped it down to 300 expectation, it'd be a lot better of a device. Because let's face it, there's nothing worse than expecting 400 puffs and then waiting a couple of hours going off and on and you're only actually halfway through what you're expecting. Damn! But there you go guys, there's not much more to say. This is a very weird chip, if you look at it, it is just square. There's no mouthpiece or anything. And there's been a few times, especially I've been driving, I've... It's not working. And that's because I've been having it the wrong way. It hadn't broken, I've had it the wrong way, which is good. But there is, it is always the colour end you have it on, and there is an error to tell you that it's that side anyway. 
Maybe it's just me. me. But I do like it, the fit in the end really good. I don't know what to say. So there you go guys, I hope you've enjoyed this review, very quick, straight to the point, disposable pods, they are good, you can't buy them in the UK I'm afraid because they're not TPD, so there you go, the only reason they're not TPD if you're wondering is because the old nicotine is higher, 50, higher than 50ml, which in the UK and other TPD countries is out of the question because the European Union decided that 20mg should be high enough. Once again, thanks to each of the click for sending me the devices. I ain't going to give away, I've used them all. Selfish me. Um, let me know what you think down below. Any questions, ask down below. Don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, over the market. Look for my channel, there's a few more disposable pods knocking about. There's some proper pods, like the Biden. Reusable, not proper. I don't know guys, thanks for watching and don't forget the most important thing you can do is stay cloudy!